The operation course demonstration for CSF-100 Preparations before flight Fully charged the battery before flight Press and hold the button to take the battery out Connect it to the charging cable And plug the cable into the power supply During charging, the indicator lights are flashing green while The battery is fully charged the lights are always on The charging time is about 4 to 5 hours Connect the remote control to the charging cable And connect it to the power supply Light is red during charging And it goes out when the battery is fully charged Blade replacement if the plate is damaged, please replace it in time. Use the attached screwdriver to screw out two fixed screws. Pull the plate upward and replace it. Select the corresponding plate and replace it according to the schematic diagram. If the plate in the A position is installed incorrectly in the B position, the UAV will not take off or get damaged. App Download and Connection After the installation, Short press and then low press the power switch to turn on the aircraft. Find the corresponding signal X drone XXX in the Wi Fi of the mobile phone to get connected. After getting connected successfully, open the app and click on the key control to enter the app control interface. Memory Card Installation Insert the memory card ceramic chip downward into the card slot. Gently press the card and it will pop out to be taken out. The memory card needs to be purchased by yourself and it requires to be 4 to 128 gigahertz above class 10. Aircraft Frequency Matching Place the aircraft on a horizontal plane. Short press and long press the aircraft power supply. Long press the remote control switch to turn on the remote control for automatic frequency matching. Reminder Before flying, the camera protective cover must be taken out and the compass and gyroscope must be calibrated before flying. Compass calibration and satellite search. Long press the compass on the remote control for 3 seconds. The rear light of the aircraft changes to flash and the compass icon on the LCD screen. At this time, enter the compass calibration, pick up the aircraft horizontally and rotate 2 to 3 circles. And the beep of the remote control X-axis is calibrated. Turn the front of the aircraft downward for 2 to 3 turns and you will hear the remote control beeps twice. The forearm light of the rear aircraft aircraft is always on. Placing the aircraft on the horizontal plane again and its rear lights will be red and green in turn. This step takes a few minutes. When the rear lights turn flickering green, it means that the satellite has been searched. In the outdoor mode, the motor can be unlocked only after the satellite is searched. Gyroscope Calibration Push the left and right rocker of the remote control to the position of 7 o'clock. When the remote control beeps, the rear light turns yellow and flashes slowly. The driver's scope will be calibrated until the light turns to normal color. Motor unlocking. Push the left rocker of the remote control to the direction of 7 o'clock and the right rocker to the direction of 5 o'clock to unlock the motor. Indoor mode switching. Long press the mode switch button of the remote control to switch to be the indoor mode. The LCD displays GPS and off, which means that GPS is turned off. Indoor mode must be turned on. It is not recommended to fly in the indoor mode, or the aircraft might get crashed and lost. Basic function demonstration. Push up the left control lever. To control the UAV to take off and go up, pull it down to control the UAV to descend and land. Turn it left to control the UAV to fly left and turn it right to fly right. The right joystick controls the UAV to fly forward, backward, left, right. Speed Adjustment Press the speed key of the remote control. A B it means low speed. 2 B it means high speed. Emergency Stop 
Aircraft encounters an emergency at low altitude. Press the following two buttons at the same time to stop and force down. Photos and videos. Shall I press the photo button on the remote control or the photo button on the app to take photos? Long press the video button on the remote control or the video button on the app to start recording. Lens adjustment. Press the lens down button on the remote control and the aircraft lens will rotate downward. Press the lens up button on the remote control will rotate outward. App function demo. The functions of app buttons are shown in the figure. GPS Smart Track. Click GPS Follow on the app, and the UAV can automatically follow the character's positioning of the mobile phone. Trajectory Flight. Click the trajectory flight icon on the app, draw the trajectory in the map, and click Send, and the aircraft will fly according to the planned route. One key return. Short press the button one key return, and remote control will beat twice, and the aircraft will automatically return, and it can only be carried out in GPS mode. That's all about the operation course demonstration for CSF one zero zero UAV.